but you know what I mean. Make sure they don't get that past you. Yep, got it, little brother. This isn't my first Velociraptor rodeo. They're almost on me. What's the plan? Well, Velociraptors chirp to talk to each other. I can speak chirp. What should I say? Tell them to stop! Stop! Uh-uh. We need you to stay here to learn a much bigger carnivore. Which dino experiment are we trying to finish again? Dino experiment 1001. What did the T-Rex really look like? 1001? I don't think my experiments went up that high, Dex. That's because I added it. Oh. But we already know what T-Rexes look like. Or maybe we just think we do. We know what their bones look like, but that doesn't mean we know what they look like. Go on. These are chicken bones, and these are T-Rex bones. Okay. But this is what a chicken looks like, and this is what we think a T-Rex looks like. You notice anything? The chicken has more fat. Ding, ding, ding. And it's not just the chicken. Check out the ostrich, cassowary, and emu. Way puffier. Ah. Nice try, buddy. Stay put. All animals have fat, but when paleo artists, those are people who draw dinosaurs based on their bones. I know. Well, just like scientists, paleo artists didn't always get everything right. So you think T-Rexes had more fat. Birds came from dinosaurs, so their bodies probably look the same. Which means everything we think we know about dinosaurs would have to be redrawn. All of it. Well, now you just need to prove it. Which is why I need this friend to lure in a T-Rex. Where is she? Oh, hold that experiment. Hey, Dad. It's what time? No, I lost track. Okay, we're coming right back. Come on, Dex. Get in, I'm late. But our experiment. We'll have to wait, buddy. Till when? You're leaving. It's only for a few months. You're off the hook for now. Oh, mom's calling now. Okay, let's get going. Hey, mom, we're just leaving now. <laughs> 